and postal voting for local bodies opens this Friday and closes on October the 12th. Joining me now is Wairoa mayoral candidate Derek Fox and Henderson Massey local board hopeful Will Flavel. Tēnā kōrua. Kia ora. Kia ora. Now, Derek, let's start with you. You're, starting, you're standing for the mayoralty of Wairoa. You've been the mayor there before. Yeah. Why are you going back? Uh, I had a group of people come and see me about 18 months ago and they sort of said, oh, we're very concerned about the council and, you know, what do you reckon we should do? So I made a few suggestions to them and away they went. Bugged me down that they didn't come back <laughs> a few months later and they said, oh, that's a good idea, really, but you've got to come with us. Mm. And um, So you're running with a group this time? Yes, well, it's, it's quite radical for White Oil. We've put together a little team. Mm. We've got four people, um, two women, two blokes, and... Um, we're running as a team that we call Team Wairoa and we're, we're saying uh, we're there to support each other. We, we have a set of principles against which we would um, sort of uh, judge all things that come before the council. And, you know, I think it's a sort of a, a more open and, um, and transparent and professional approach. And, mm. you know, we just have to see if the voters agree with us. Mm, for sure. And, Will, you're the head of Māori at Rutherford College at the moment. Yep. I met your sister last night at the Pikihuia Writers sure. Award. She said that you're the man. Oh, so yeah. you, why have you entered the race for the Henderson Messi local board? Well, I'm fortunate to be one of the Labour Party candidates for Henderson Messi. And if you look at the current board of those eight members, there are no Māori, there are no Pacifica, and there's no one under the age of 45 years old. And that, to me, doesn't reflect the true diversity of our region, considering that 40% are under under the age of uh, 24 years old and a fifth are of Māori so um, I'm putting my hat in the race to ensure that um, there is a Māori voice and there is a rangatahi voice. Mm. Mm. And that's a major issue confronting all of our local boards across the country isn't it Derek? Yeah, There's yes, very it few Māori yes, on there. Yes it is. Uh, traditionally um, fewer than 4% of local body represent. Why, why is that? Well a number of reasons I guess that um, first of all they probably don't get nominated and secondly uh, because our people say, look, this has got nothing to do with me, I, you know, I, I, it doesn't mean anything to me, I, uh, uh, and uh, some of them say, I, I don't want the government to know where I am, so they, they don't enroll, they don't vote. I mean, you know, Wairo, uh, the majority of people who live in Wairo are Māori. Mm -hmm. It's the only local government district mm -hmm. in the country where that's the case. So there should be quite a strong presence on the Māori Council. Mm -hmm. And of the current seven members of the Wairo Council, to a Māori. Now that's, you know, that's quite good um, um, compared to other districts. Voter turnout is another problem, mm. especially with Māori. Mm. Mm. Not very good at voting in these local elections, mm. but Will, I know you've got a, a strategy in place that's going to get a few Māori out voting for you? Well, um, the Labor, so I'm part of a Labour Party ticket and we've been working six months on this campaign and we've been going to all sorts of different community events. We've been door knocking, uh, we've been talking in schools. So. Um, you know, young Māori, they want to see a young face, they want to see a, 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 a person who, who, real, who understands the dreams and aspirations of our young people, considering that, you know, we've got a lot, you know, the average age of Māori across New Zealand is quite relatively yeah. young as well. And, and looking at that Te Tai Tokuro story, it's much younger than Te Tai Tokuro, 50% in the northern region are under the age of, you know, 23 years old, so it's important that we mobilise our, our young people. But I also would think there's, there's merit in, in voting online, which hopefully in the future or very soon we could be able to do something mm -hmm. like that. Have you got an online strategy, Derek? <laughs> <laughs> yep, we've got a Facebook page. Oh, very uh, good, very good. Thank, thankfully someone else is running it, not me. Um, no, but that, I, I'm picking that the work they do mm. will show a jump in, in, the, in the turnout of Māori, in the turnout generally, the turnout of Māori and the turnout of young people. Mm -hmm. uh, in the past, when I ran for the Wairo Meralty, there was a jump too. Mm. But last time it was back to... 57% turnout, which is about average or even maybe slightly a over average um, for New Zealand in general. Mm -hmm. Well, I wish you both all the best for the elections coming up. I hope both of you are successful. Thank, Thank you very you. much. Kill Thank you very much for your time. So do this we. <laughs> Maybe if you promise everybody that you'll hold yeah, the Ranfurly Shield a bit longer in the Hawks <laughs> Bay, you'll get the mayoralty, Derek. Okay.